Hey everyone, today we're doing a video on warm-ups. Which warm-ups go with which exercises and workouts is something that people might be a little confused on. I have written a blog post and I linked it down below for you to give a read so you can get more in depth with the whys in the house. Let's get warmed up. Here we'll be using a resistant band. Place it right around your hands. Your feet are going to be hip width apart, knees soft, abs in tight, arms above your head and they're going to be locked out. Your palms are going to be facing inward towards each other and you're going to be pulling outward using your lats, your shoulders, your triceps and your biceps. Be sure not to be pulling with your hands. Next, rotate your palms forward, grip the band and you're going to keep one arm locked out above you and the other one's going to be pulling down, mimicking a lat pull down movement. You'll be warming up your lats, your triceps, and your delts with this warm up. Be sure to switch sides with every movement. Keep your abs drawn in, sights forward, knees soft, and muscles engaged. Bring your hands down to chest height. Grip the band and palms are gonna face downward. Don't pull with the hands, but pull through the back of your arms. You're going to have your arms not locked out here, but like there's a beach ball between you and the band. Abs are in tight and pull back. Try to squeeze your shoulder blades as well. Those muscles are called your rhomboids. Triceps, chest, and back are warming up here. Next, you're going to bring the band around your shoe. You're going to Activate your bicep and you're going to start to curl up. Be sure to keep your abs in tight and use your bicep to curl that band up. Go slowly and controlled. We are now changing our grip to be facing inward towards our body. We're going to row backwards. Squeeze those rhomboid muscles between your shoulder blades your abs tight and exhale as you bring it up. I like to hold for a quick second at the top of each movement so that you let every single muscle fiber engage. Going fast is not the point here. Next, I'm moving on to a fabric band. This band keeps from rolling upwards on your leg and you're going to place it right above your knees. You're going to be in a tabletop position and you're going to move down to your forearms and slide your hips back. Squeeze your glutes and your abs at the same time as you drive all your weight through your heel back in a diagonal. Exhale as you press your heel back. Flex your glutes and your abs as you press backwards. This is going to warm up your core and your glute muscles. Try your very best to be as diagonal as you possibly can from heel to head. We're going to bring our legs straight out now, pointing our toe. You're going to lift and tap. Squeeze your glute and lift your leg up by flexing that glute muscle. Tap down. Move slowly. The band will want to force you to move fast, but you will move slow. Now we're going to be warming up our side glute. You're going to plant one hand in front of you and the other one's going to stay down. You're going to open up your hips ever so slightly and you're going to flex that glute as you hydrant your leg up, holding that 90 degree bend. This is the hardest one. Be sure to hold steady. Don't rock your body and keep your core nice and tight.
We are moving on to our back now. We're gonna lay straight back with our knees bent, abs are in tight. You're gonna drive through your heels and you're gonna squeeze your glutes up and when you hit the top, you're gonna butterfly out just a bit. Don't touch the ground when you lower. This is our last banded move, and this one is for your quad muscles, the tops of your thighs. You're gonna put the band around one foot underneath and then around the top of your other foot. Lean back, planting your hands behind you, and you're going to extend that thigh. Extend that leg, you're gonna shake. This is gonna be a hard one. Exhale as you extend that leg so that you can brace all your muscles and you can stay steady. You could take off that band and we're moving on. shoulder width apart, put your feet together, squeeze your heels together, flex your glutes together, and then tuck your abs up and in. Press weight through your hands down into the ground. Now separate your feet into a rocking motion, keeping your abs nice and flat.
hope you liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, hit subscribe, and share it with somebody you think might need a, a, a warm-up idea. Bye.